Everybody. Welcome back. Jiu Jitsu 2000 here today. I'm back with an interesting video for you today. I want to show you the Lodge 5 quart cast iron Dutch oven. This is a this is a stovetop type Dutch oven. This ain't the type that you can use out at camp where you put the it has the little rim on the outside where you can put the coals on top and the little legs. But you can use this in that application if you had to but it's not what this is designed for again this is designed for the stove top this is a really cool cast iron lodge makes beautiful stuff these things come pre-seasoned and I'm really excited about using this I know that when I do any kind of deep frying or if I make fried chicken or anything like that I love using cast iron it's, it just holds the heat so much better so I picked this up actually I got it for my birthday present <laughs> so the first uh, look you can see that the lid has these little things on it I don't even know what you call it, these little points now for those of you that don't understand what those points are for this is a basting lid. What that does is when the steam that comes from whatever you're cooking goes into the top. Here's an older one that I have. It gets on these and the steam eventually falls off of these and self bastes your meat that's inside the oven. So they come very well packaged. You can obviously see that looks like they missed a little bit on the quality control right there looks like that might need to be hit with a grinder a little bit nothing too major though but this is a beautiful cast iron so here we have the lodge cast iron cookware information basically talking about the legacy of lodge that they're pre-season feel free to pause the video if you want to read any of this information it's pretty cool I'm a firm believer of Lodge cast iron products. I have quite a few of them. You know, I kind of originally thought, why would I, why would I do a video on this? I mean, it's a pretty common product, but I'm glad that I did. So here's a little handout that you get. It shows some of their other stuff. And I honestly think that Lodge makes like the best cast iron gear. I really do. Their stuff is just off the hook. I have quite a few. Now this is the one I have right here. This is the five quart. Where is that? Number four. So that's the five quart right there. That's the one I got right here. Except it has a different uh, kind of lid. Because those handles are different. But you can see that this catalog has like a lot of their information. That'd be cool make some pizzas but lodge I mean they're just amazing they don't this this pot doesn't have the legs on the bottom so that you could set it over to coals out at camp this is a stovetop version so you can make a pot of beans you know again you have a self basting lid if you really wanted to use it at camp you could I mean you could put coals on top of this if you had to that's not really, that's not really what this model is designed for so I'm, I'm gonna take a grinder here and I'm gonna kinda trim this little area off on the inside I don't think it's you know something that I'd take it back for I mean it's something I can take care of myself really nice products I was hoping to find now that hibachi grill is something that might be interesting. I think it's kind of cool, like 105 bucks or something. I don't know. I was hoping there'd be some. Now that's the one I was talking about. See the rim, and then they they have the legs. Keeps them up off the coal, up off the coals, and then you put the coals around the rim. I use those type a lot. 
this in fact is my first one that that is a five quart anyway that that I can use here at the house so I'm really excited about it um, folks I want to say thank you for joining me today on unboxing this new lodge I'm really excited about it I can't wait to cook on this thing it's gonna be great and they last for a long long time hope you got some good useful information out of this video please feel free to leave your comments down below like this video share this video and if you like the content on my channel please subscribe I'd love to have you and until next time folks have a beautiful day bye bye